Hey guys, how's it going? Alan here, back again with yet another reaction video. So there's so much stuff going on right now with SB19. Uh, besides, uh, I think they just completed their uh, concert for Pepsi. There's that Billboard thing. There's Grammys, uh, possibly a nomination, which is very, very exciting and well deserved. So so much stuff going on, and and then I just want to kind of like uh, take a step back and kind of like uh, just chill with SB19. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. My favorite uh, music songs from SB19 is actually the ballads. I just love ballads. They did uh, recently Lee Ham and uh, Ilao, which are just phenomenal, very well written by Pablo, and I just love those songs. But I want to go back to an older song. Uh, I think this might have been off of the uh, first uh, album. I know uh, uh, not Hanggang Sa Huli, but uh, Tira Luha is off of their first album. I, I'm not sure, but I think... Uh, Hangang Sahuli is also off of, of the same album. But anyway, that's what we're going to be watching. And Stel mentioned it uh, in one of the interviews that this is also his favorite uh, SB19 song. It's uh, Hangang Sahuli. So uh, we're going to be watching two. The first one's going to be uh, Ken covering uh, Hangang Sahuli with, uh, I think, um, Stel comes in later on. And this is uh, two years old. It looks uh, older than two years old uh, looking at Ken's... Uh, picture here but uh maybe it was recorded earlier uh but he didn't upload it till like two years uh, two years ago but also i think this is one of his uh, first live streams so uh he, he's uh probably gonna be nervous on this one and then the second one is a three-year-old uh video and it's uh still this time doing the cover and then uh pablo i think uh, accompanying him so anyway without any further ado let's go ahead and get started with the first one kung ano yung hanggang sa uli na OST version he just Ken. looks so young SB19 Ken covering SB19's hanggang sa huli sana walang walang copyright sa sana hindi ako makakapit dito sige let's go hanggang sa huli <laughs> oh man this is not an easy song to cover especially the high notes I'm only saying that it's not it's not that skill is not or or Ken is not skilled or talented. I'm just saying this is gonna be a little hard for him to cover just because he's got that low registry, uh his uh, his voice. And then there's parts of the song, Stealth's part, which are really high. And I know he can do really good falsetto, but I don't know how how he is in that range. I mean he can use his head voice obviously, but uh let's just Let's see. The smile the whole time he's singing. So far, so good. He sounds awesome. And this is his part, so... Hey! Oh! not seen this video that that is so funny him asking Stel for help here's the thing with Ken I think he's capable of singing this whole song all the parts because I've heard him sing yeah with a high voice using falsetto and he's really good at it maybe earlier on he kind of like lacked the uh, the confidence I know that uh, Pablo is a big part while uh, he was able to come out of his shell and become Philippe, right? Which which is just awesome, full of swag and confidence. But this is before that, so he's probably still kind of like in that shell and, and hasn't really blossomed to the Ken that we all know now. But anyway. See, that's pretty good. 
Sounds good with the mid range. Oh, he comes tell. There's still. <laughs> Oh. Go Stel, go! Help him! Oh yeah! Stel's just awesome. So helpful and he sounds great. <laughs> That's the thing with uh, with Ken, right? If he sings this song now, like if he does the cover now, I bet you he's not gonna sound anything like this. He's just improved so much uh, within the last two three years that he can cover this no problem. But back then, it was kind of like funny how. He felt like he was limited, but that's probably not true. He can probably like build this out if he really is trying, but he's just not feeling confident, I think. Of course, of, of course, Stel has always been a, a great singer, even from the very beginning. So this is like something he could have, he would have been able to do even going back. <laughs> so funny. And then he's good. Of course, that's something he can always do, even back then, doing those runs. He's always been good at that. Oh, well, that was, that was, that was funny. So, uh, let's pause this, pause, pause. Uh, let's go ahead and watch the other one. So, this is the same song, and this time it's going to be... Uh, Yeah, hold on. Pause. Yeah, I just want to make sure. But uh, this is the uh, other one, other cover of Hang and Soli with uh, says here, uh, Stellan uh, Sejun. I guess he's going by Sejun back then. But anyway, let's go watch this one. And this is uh, three years ago, uh, uh, based on the upload. You know what? I think I made a mistake. This is this is Hangang Sauli in Jeju. This is not what I wanted to see. What I wanted to see is the. Uh, is the one with Stell and Pablo. 
kung ano yung hanggang sa uli. Hold on guys, bear with me. I have a new setup here in case you guys haven't noticed. I'm actually using a real microphone and, and uh, I'm, I'm using a, a, an app for editing and stuff. So I'm just still getting used to it. So bear with me with this one. Okay, this is the one. Yeah, this is the one with uh, Stell and uh, Pablo. AKA Sejun. Pablo doing his uh, warm ups. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny how pablo is just making stale sing the whole thing i think one of pablo's um uh, skills or one of the favorite things that he likes to do uh is uh support his bandmates and, and do um harmonies he's probably the one member that does the the most harmonies out of uh, everybody and, and he can pretty much harmonize with everybody uh he sounds good with every single member of uh sb19 he just has that uh, ability in, in his uh vocal range he can go really high and he can go really low and somewhere in the middle and he just knows you know pablo just knows what that part needs and either he's like um adding on like like uh, filling in the gaps or he's harmonizing either way he does a phenomenal job doing that i'm sorry if you can hear my uh son in the background uh, playing drums i apologize but he's in the garage right now uh practicing his drums so uh i hope you don't hear too much of that but anyway uh let's keep going with this one so far i mean it's it's different of course um besides uh uh, still having a higher uh, tone or, or registry in his voice. Uh, he's got Pablo. He's who's who's like the best when it comes to like backing uh, vocals. See. Pablo went even higher than Stell on, on that part. Still sounds really good too, singing, you know, down here. <laughs> Pablo is just like, I just want to back you up, man. I don't want to par. I don't want to sing any of the other part. I just want to back you up. Still's like, oh, I guess. <laughs>
listen to that. That is so good, Pablo. Let's listen to that again. Listen to this part. So good. He's so good at that. Finally. <laughs> He's like, I'm done. You're ba you're you're back on, Stell. Look at <laughs> this guy's. You can tell this whole thing was not planned, but that's how good they are. They didn't need to prepare. Just. <laughs> Pablo is just not ready. He's... He needed to get into the uh, feels. I was like, I'm, I'm out of here. I'm done. <laughs> yeah. Both videos were great. I mean, that's what I like about the SB19, you know, like, like the camaraderie, the brotherhood. They love for each other and they care uh, for one another, right? And, and it just shows. Uh, whether it's uh, Stell and uh, Ken, and then now it's uh, Stell and Pablo, they are just really good at uh, helping each other <laughs> and both really, really funny. I just love this song and, and I really like both versions. And um, yeah, that was a lot of fun. Thank you for watching, you guys. Uh, I'll see you on my next upload. Until then, take care.